Welcome to Factorio Reverse Megabase. My name is Nila, so this is episode 23 of our Let's Play campaign. What we want to do today is finish up the yellow science so that that is now fully operational and we can move on to other things as well. Uh, however, hmm, well, well, there is a problem. I let this run for a bit just to see how it would stabilize. And well, it's stable, all right. But the problem is it's stable as in not working, which is a stable, stable, a steady state. So, okay, there was a comment about why the batteries were slightly slow and that was uh, this beacon was missing the modules. So thank you for highlighting that. And so here, this is an issue because of sulfuric acid. Why do we not have sulfuric acid? We should have plenty of that here because we don't have sulfur. Why do we not have sulfur? Because we don't have petroleum. Why do we not have petroleum? That's up here. Why do we not have petroleum? Um, because these refineries have stopped. Why do they have stopped? Because the heavy oil has stopped. Why did the heavy oil stop? Because this one apparently started working too early. So what I need to do is I actually need to, and I, I did not think I would have to, but it looks like I do have to do this. So I do need to make sure that I have a storage of heavy oil here and that heavy oil has to be stocked up too. Oops. These two need to be connected and from here into that one. So I can't limit the amount of, I can't limit the heavy oil coming in here. But what I can do is I can limit the output. And that's also going to be on this one here. So basically, yes, I can do just a bit of it, but I can't keep doing this until I'm sure that I have enough storage over here. So these two will jam because this one is not active. These two will jam quickly as well because this one is not active. So these all have to be set to a condition that says they only are active when the amount of storage here is, let's say 1000. It doesn't have to be much, just has to be something there. And that one. So what I need to do is just give a little, give it a little push. There we go. And then take that out. Then we have 3.2. And it should uh, should now work. These ones are active and now it works exactly as it did before. The only difference is that if this should for some reason start declining and it could be, it's actually declining now. Um, this is, it's good to see that this one's declining because if it's declining, that is the indicator of what the problem is. And the indicator, the problem is that this going out here it's actually not particularly likely to ever go to this one. So you can see the pump speed here. Yeah, it's pumping a bit, but it's not really pumping a lot. And well, right now it hovers, but uh, I, apparently I couldn't rely on this. But now I will have sort of a backup here. So that's actually really nice. And what I can do is now I can move on to the next challenge. Uh, this one does a comment about the train here. It should be a 16 train for, for that one. So that's, uh, that's also okay. So what I'm going to do here is should be pretty simple. At least I'd like it to be pretty simple. And by that, I mean, we've already, we've already made one of this. This is low density structure. So let's try and see if we can uh, utilize what we've already built and as much as possible, just recycle it. And uh, so that means the majority of what we need to do is actually the train setup. So we already have this one and I have inbound 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 and one outbound if i look at it compare it to this one then i could oh, to this one then i think i'd actually have exactly like it so i'll take i'll take this one this one will be uh, actually i want to take it from here there and I know that this one will belong to this location, but I don't need this or this. Got it. Oops, wrong. And one is off, two is off. There we go. And This is one of the things I really like is that when you have modularized things, it uh, should be pretty good. This one, I don't like it being 
using that connection. I don't like it having the same name when it's not on the same network. Because then I'm getting it confused. So that one goes back and forth here. I'm going to take the other one. The other one is going to be here. Ooh, that's not great, actually. I don't like it at this point. This one should be further out. I don't like these locations. If you look at this, this is one, two. And yeah, it's much better to have it like that. Let's see, I've, I've sort of matured that. This one is better. And let's look at these down here. Yeah. Yes. So those are the ones I need, right? I, I need one that goes up. Also need one over here. Yes, let's see. Um, this one. Should be in this location. Next one. And hold on, what is that going to be? That's going to be the plastic. Okay. And I'm going to get the copper up top. So the copper up top should be over there. And then this one should be, uh, that should be steel, which is a small one. So a small one should be more like that location. Huh? And that is here. Okay, so now I have the inputs and outputs. This is going to be, yep. <clears throat> Up here, we are going to make the changes. This will be the steel inbound. Okay, so this will be called steel for something. Steel inbound, yes. Steel inbound. And we'll just see if that's... Yeah, okay. These are inbounds or out... Uh, that's a loading station. So don't make it a loading station. That's good. This one up here. I'm going to go up and build it. Got it. This one. And that will be the copper coming in. Oops, I missed the... That part. Here. This is copper inbound. I should have a copper in. Yep. They're all going to be the same. And over on this part, uh, missing some things all the way up here. Right. Nope, not anymore. Just meet the nice looking outputs. And down here, this will be plastic then. Should have a plastic in as well. Plastic in. Yes. So with that being done, we now have all of the uh, here. I can look at my calculator and see that I need a total of 35 point something. So that's going to be 36. And I'm going to go up here and take this one. And uh, let's see. I have to remind myself how they did this. Let me just check this. Okay, so this one was scaled up towards 80. That one here is the constraint. Because that's a half belt and it's a half belt. Okay, so maybe we should make these things. And just uh, the question is then how many of those we need. Right. And yeah, just make it in the middle and we'll see what it works. And then with the new mods, we don't have, it doesn't work unless it's powered. So got to get it powered. Uh, there, no, there. And the rate calculator will tell us we have now 11, 22. 33. Well, that's not great, is it? That's actually pretty damn miserable. It has a wrong shape and 
I think we need something like this because it's a much more even number. And then I can always just knock some of it out. This is way too much. Let's have a look at how much too much it is. There, it's 44. This is exactly this, the build we had on the other side. Uh, don't think I want that. Don't know if it's safe to just... That was way too much. It took out by accident. I can take this part out. And... Maybe also this one. Here. Let's see if that's closer to our 35.8. It's enough. And what are we missing in terms of this? I need that one. Okay. We're just going to see if anything here. So now I have on this part, I have a total of eight. And it looks like this branch is bef after number three, which is not correct. It should be branching after number four. That one. Yes, so that needs to be done. And now this one is ready to go. We have all of what we need. There we go. 55. And all I need is now a check to see that I that one is in the middle and that was in is in the middle. So I'm going to take this out, including this, and try to align it towards the middle. Getting up here, and I think that must be the middle. Yes, it is. There. Get all this out and just build it again. And let's see. How did I not get that? Shouldn't be that difficult. We'll build it right there. I don't need this, and I don't need this anymore. So what we have now is everything coming into the middle. What we just need is uh, links out on the side. I'm going to figure out that one. And I think that's fine. I like that actually up here. I like it. So we're going to take this exact thing without this because of that one. So let's uh, take... Hey, it works perfectly. It works perfectly. That one. And I'll take the next one. Moving on. What about here? Okay, that's copper. I also think this is good. At least to this point, but without those grids. Moving up to... Also works perfectly. It does not get into trouble with the substations. Perfect. And the last one is going to be plastic, which isn't really a big deal, I guess. So I'm going to take this one. I know that there's... Ooh, ah, oh, that that I don't like. Do I? Maybe I do. I don't know. None of these, and let's see if we can build that. Yeah, there's definitely going to be some issues here. Okay, let's start by taking this out because that's not really necessary right now. Try again. Boom. And that's not necessary. And now there's that one. And all of this. Yeah. That is good. And all I need is now the merging thing. And again, I want to reuse as much as possible what we can reuse. So let's try and reuse this. I think we'll re try to reuse all of this. It is a nice build to link things together. That one. Mm, maybe not, actually. Kind of don't want this one. Then You could have been, you could build like this instead. Inbound, 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 inbound. And now I try it again. Without this one.
And that looks good. All we need is inbound on the iron side. Or sorry, steel side. Steel is now inbound. Come on robots, get in there. Yeah, we want to be reusing things if we can, because, well, if I've already built it once, then there's no point in redesigning the same thing again. That's also not as interesting to re redesign the same thing. Uh, this one. Let's get these done there. And try to figure out. So I have each of these will be one, right? I have 16 tiles here and I have 16 wagons. So this one will go to these two go to that one. These two go to that one. Okay. That one's good, and this one will now be even. Okay, so it's clearly not as, it's not symmetric at this point. Uh, how big of an issue is that? It's not really much of an issue from Aside from an aesthetic perspective, and you know, I think it's still gonna look nice when it starts flowing. But it does kind of get more and more into trouble here. Especially this one. This one's just, that's gonna be the worst. Yeah, somehow those turned out to be not important at all. Neither are these. And he does this. Okay, so when that's done, we can hook up this part, which will go into here. That means I just need a bouncer, but I think I actually need a lane bouncer as well. So do we need this lane bouncer or do we want to try the new lane bouncer? I think we like the new lane bouncer more. Yeah, this is actually, this kind of sucks, right? This one is the middle. Why am I not taking all of this then in the middle? just doesn't seem right like all of this all right so now we put up the fake trains and once we have the fake trains then everything is gonna work here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope. Now I'm getting worried. Did I just not count to eight or what? Nope. I yeah, that's correct. I did not count to eight correctly. I'm going to kill these two and then make infinite filter steel. Got it. And cut these, and then get the infant, the train for plastic. Also going to be a big train. I'm actually thinking that the majority part of this space and the most sort of, I don't know, most difficult part will actually be getting, uh, making all the outer materials because they are going to be the biggest ones. Oops, did that work? It did work. They'll be the ones that actually really constrained. And like building a plastic location, building a copper location, iron location, figuring out how big they actually have to be to service the whole damn thing. That one, and I can then take, uh, nope, copper. And I will build that one.
and these will go in. Cool. So let's see if this is working. Pretty sure we can get this done. So far, nothing is coming out. First minuscule things are coming out. But before we do that, uh, let's actually find our... Oops, that's out here. There. The measurement. Let's see if that is actually working now. And uh, that's the first first thing. I can also build a train here while I'm waiting, while I see that it stacks up. This will be an actual real train. There. And this train will be focusing on going from this location until full. And then it'll go to the only other one that I can actually reach. And that one's until empty. Yep. And go. We'll eventually have two of these. And let me see what did we expect the material was. Oh, yeah, we can also do that now. That's pretty cool. 55 point, 35.8. So I should see 358 on this one. 358. I'm going to call it 358. It sometimes goes to 60, 360. I'm happy. I'll uh, link this one in. And remove this. Great, that was a good measurement. Uh, cannot insert low density, well, it doesn't matter. And this one is now done. I am happy. I am going to also take this fake train out. And I know that it's kind of too early, but I still want to do it. Did we get, yeah, we do have one behind. And here comes train. I think we should just always have two trains for this. It would be so cool if I could just replace that, but nope. Uh, I need you to stop. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And are these connected? Connect rolling stock. Oh yeah, I used the key. I used it. Copy, paste, go. Right, that was one. Can we do the other one as well? Because... Uh, I think that's uh, it's very oh it's uh, as pretty valuable for us to do these kind of things as uh, quickly as possible. I'm gonna take uh, I'm gonna take this one here, and I'm not gonna take that. I am not gonna take that, but I am gonna take the tiles, and that means I go up here and build it. <sighs> Crap! See, it has this output thing. That's too close. I did not want it to be merging into that one, so take this part. Not that, not that, but this. Yeah, let's get this one done. And the next one is the top. I'll take this and tiles ah that's so close so close don't get why this one is like that yeah Okay, and the last one is this one down here. And don't take these, but take tiles. Oh, oh it's actually up here, that's fine. Uh, no. Must be this one. Yep, that looks good. Move up there and then take the other one. Uh, 
Is it merging correctly here? Is it merging correctly? It's almost correct, but then again, almost is, we know about that, yeah? Here? That one is also weird. And I guess so is this one. Yeah, so there we have three outputs from this one. And the next one we need to make is the blue circuits. I don't think we can make it, but let's just jump there and see what we have. All right, here we are. And what I'd like to do now is just see if we can make the blue circuits as well, because we do have some blue circuit build, so we should be able to copy it. What if we look at this blue circuit build here? 26. 0.88 and I need 23.8 so this thing is actually just fine and it needs red circuits inbound that I don't know if we're building outside but it looks like we're building them outside so all it needs like I need this part and that's basically it right and it also needs the fuel part so oops so we just copy this go And then just take a look at, place it down and then see what the, so this one is actually solving a problem that we did not have. And by that, I mean, it's, this one is necessary because, oh, okay. First, first of all, we need to make sure that it's powered. Otherwise it will come keep complaining here. And I will see this part is using four, 48? Really? Really, really? Uh, let's pretend that it's only 40. What is also coming down from here? One, two, three, two, that one. Yeah, so if this is, let's say, okay. So if this is 45 instead of 48, that means I'm gonna get 3.36. That's the output but that needs to be divided by 48 and multiplied by 45. There, that's 315. And then I need to, because I want to see if that's the whole thing is correct. I, how many rows do I have? I have eight rows and then I multiply by eight. There, 25.2, it's still enough. Okay, so what I have is a copper, green circuits coming in here, red circuits coming in here, red is very low and oil being free of charge. All right. And that goes out on this side. And I can also say that I do not lead this. I'll build it this way because then it's the last one will pick always from the outside lane, which should, it really shouldn't be making it, shouldn't be a problem, but it's going to be making it so much easier. Just a tiny bit easier actually. Okay. So I need now the oil parts as well. Do we have any oil here? Yes, we do. So that's super simple to get some oil for this one. So I just need this little teeny tiny one. The only problem is that it also needs some iron that I also have. So I'm going to actually make it over on this corner. Because why not? Why not indeed? I'll make it out here. And the only things that I'm missing now is a green circuit in here, red circuit in here and then hook it up and then that one as well. Cool. Um, I am going to find, let's see. The red one is out here. Red is a big train, right? Red is a big train. Yes, it is a big train here. We have reds. I'm going to take you. Not actually sure I want all of it. I think this low unload is too much. Because I don't need that much. Uh, I think they'll take this here. And red circuits are coming in from this side. Great. And I'm definitely going to take... All of these out. So that's the red circuit. It matches all these and the green ones is going to be like, oh, it's not going to be like this one. Well, 
Kind of. None of these, none of these, none of these, none of these. And what else? None of this. It's still going to be fitting on this one. Only difference is that it's going to be a bit longer and, well, different. That one's going out here. Okay, so how... That one's out. Uh, this... Not that, not that, not that. Now I get the size of it here. That's the green circuits, that's the red circuits, and the blue circuits are coming here. Mm. How do I do the blue circuits? I'm gonna take one of these, this one. Like that, except different. Except none of this, none of this. Just desperately trying to get this done. Because I, I want to show how quickly we can actually build these kind of things. Now that we are more comfortable with it that is good so that's the green inbound this is the no, blue outbound green inbound red inbound let's get those and see this one is the short one it would go further down if it was the long one uh, that is also here take this Boom, perfect. That's where this one merges in. And from down here, we have green circuits coming out and I need a lot of green circuits. I need eight full lanes of green circuits, no more, no less. Let's get the eight green lanes. How do we unload green circuits? That one, Ugh, robots. How do we unload something that high quantity and that is probably a good <laughs> good solution. Let's get it. It's also green circuits. No, like this. Green circuits. How do I... Crap. How do I know where it's supposed to be? How do I know that? I really like this one. Oh, oh uh, that one, I think. It is actually correct. I'll just take all of this then. Should be fine. Yes. Boom. And there will be some weird stuff there, there. And that's going to be it. This one will now be green inbound. And eh, don't like that one. It's going to be just be green in. Perfect. Green in here. That needs to go up and the red inbound kind of has to be the same, right? It doesn't, it really doesn't need to be that much. I'm needing like three half lanes in. So that's way overkill. Uh, let's get something where we get a big train, but a small and a modest offload. That's a modest offload to a big train. And I can't use the rest of it because that's not trustworthy, but I can use this part. Cool. So I'm going to get into that one and that one. And they will all need to be on the inside belts. So this is where we built the loader. The, weird, the, the broken balancer. That one, the broken balancer. There, that broken balancer is still our go-to thing. So we need a eight to three belt. Mm. 
I doubt they are going to be useful. Let's find and see if an, what an 823 belt looks like in these days. This day and age. One, two, three, four. So this is going to be the middle. Yeah. Uh, what? That does not look like a three output. Seven to two, seven to three. Well, that looks even worse. Uh, that is exactly in the middle, so we'll keep this exactly in the middle, right? There. Okay. And this is exactly in the middle, so this is not. Neither is that. That's in the middle, and we don't have anything from top. We have this one. This is more important. And these now go into an 8 to 8 splitter, right? 8 to 8. So we need to look at a good 8 to 8 splitter. What do we got? Uh, blue. What? This one is not red blue. I don't know why it says red blue. There. That's TU. That's throughput unlimited. So let's build that one here. And get some kind of... You can just go over there and so I want to build this like that and then figure out where the middle is for this. It's undo build. Let's check from here. It goes all right from here. Perfect. All right, so now belts right we can we can do belts but uh, let's see if we can uh, fast forward through the belting part And so we have the belts and I think that I can now officially uh, attest that I am a fan of the new belt weaving. Belt weaving thing looks absolutely brilliant this part. Let's uh, add some trains and add some oil and coal. That should be pretty easy this one. I'll just build this one. I think I'll build it sort of. I'll build it like this and we just need some oil. Then I really can't imagine we need very much oil. There. Seriously? Yeah. That one. So that gets started. This one is uh, is iron and I don't know where we want the iron, but let's get out here. Um, how? What is the northernmost part? I have to get really way too close to this, so just get this. And that's another mining productivity. There. And that's actually not good. That one, that one is better. And I will do a few. Yep. There. That should be fine. There's no way that this not going to be fine. How much is it? It's several hundred thousand. Should be fine. Okay, so iron goes in, and that's going to be part of the making the sulfur, or sulfuric acid. That should be fine. This goes in here, and the one thing that we don't have is actually the this in on the right side. That's okay. You can just make it. 
here instead. The, again, the quantities are not particularly overwhelming, so just get it. There, much easier to do. This out, this out, this out, and it's time for hooking this one up. Let's hook it up. Is it working? Are we outputting? Not really. Oh, water. Mm, yeah, there was the water part. Yeah, please look away if you don't like the water part. I really don't. Uh... Is that two tiles? Three tiles? Three tiles. Oops, don't stand on it. Then that would be pretty stupid. And get a water pump here. Got it. That should... You're not getting the water. No. Oh, the water's coming from that one. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Never mind then. Don't mind me. And I'll just make it over here instead. Boom. Everyone's happy. Oh, and that's a me reminder that I need to get my kid back to school. Okay, but, you know, they can be a bit late, can they? Because we got important things to do. Better, more important than homeschooling is wrapping this one up. And you know we have to see this in action, right? We have to see it in action. This one is going to be greens. Let's go. There. And then we get the red ones in here nope all right so this is definitely more of a it's definitely a mega base build this part and i know that some people don't really like the idea of this of, of this way of, of building uh, I really like it I think it's uh, it's very nice and it's, I like really doing something that's different from what I've done before and uh, I think that's also important for me to do things that are different because otherwise I'll just go insane I need a blue circuit that one cool that one blue circuits you are gonna go to blue circuits until full and you're gonna go to that one until empty go and we are now getting this inbound i'm happy all right there we go we have now built two of those tiles and we are now done with green with with the uh, yellow circuits sorry the yellow science futility science and i'll you know wouldn't it even wouldn't it be even better to just do this part and just take another train go like just trains but also train fuel but none that just take this and kill this one instead. There. Much, much easier. So, thank you very much everyone for joining. What we're going to do now is we're going to go into the production science and blue science. Those are the only two missing. So, a couple of episodes for blue, a couple of episodes for purple. And then we're going to start on what I think is the most challenging part is the surroundings here so let's take a look at that uh, afterwards so thank you very much for watching i hope you're enjoying this series and i hope that you will be continue to following it uh, until next time take care and stay effective